She labeled her series like Unbig My Back. And I just felt that because like, I wanna unbig my back. When I say my glutes are on fire. Just made it. I'm looking a little, um, yeah. But we here, we are here. Here is one of the yogurts that I picked up yesterday. Y'all, when I, it looks so bomb. Look what came, look what was outside the door. Here is the final finished product. It took me about 20 minutes to separate everything. But I just like set each ingredient bag with the directions or whatever. So I don't get them mixed up. And here is my meat, literally the same thing as HelloFresh, except way cheaper. So I'm gonna freeze my meat. That's the only thing I did not put in the bags, but period. So I am good to go for the week, guys. Bro, I cannot make this up. Look how much everything just came. Hold on. <sighs> Look at all of this stuff. I legitimately have no space for it. I don't know what to do. It's crazy because y'all seen the box come and it was my intentions to cancel my membership before another one came. Cause y'all it's cheap when you first doing it and signing up. But then after that, like they literally whacking your account weekly. And I'm like, bro, I forgot to cancel my membership. Whacked my account for $70. I'm like, oh, I was mad. <laughs> but then again, I got over it. Cause I'm like, okay, I got meals for like at least the next 12 days. But realistically, I don't cook every day. Um, but, oh, but I already got like plenty of every plates in the fridge that I barely got space for. Then on top of that, another box got delivered with only three meals, which was weird. Then another one came with six meals. So I'm like, bro, y'all, I'm definitely cooking this stuff up. Tonight I did make another flatbread pizza. Y'all, they flatbread pizzas are fire. Cause one thing about it, I'm gonna cook me a flatbread. And it's weird cause in this box, they sent me literally like three different flatbread recipes. So I'm like, whoa. But I did make one tonight. I made the barbecue and pineapple flatbread. I will insert the video now. <laughs> But y'all, it was good. It was so, so good. So yeah, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with all this stuff. Low key, I'm finna just separate the meat and throw that box in the fridge, try to see if it'll fit. Don't mind my um, edges, don't look too close. It's not dandruff. All this white stuff is product buildup. And I was gonna try to like slick my leave out down, you know, so I could be a little presentable at the gym. But being realistic, I'm not finna do all that like, it's nighttime, it's past 9 p.m. I just wanna get my workout in, come to the house. Y'all probably think I'm a bum because I feel like I don't never do my hair on camera. For those of you who know, you know, like you, you know what's going on, you know what it is. But anyways, yes, I got my little same black sweater on from Target because it's black, it's convenient. And I think I need to go more sweater shopping, but this is going to have to do. Y'all gonna get sick of me in it. But it is what it is. We here, we are here. Shake it like a mirror, baby. Come on, and dance with me. Come on. Shake it like a mirror, baby. Come on, and dance with me.
let me tell y'all i just had to do the most just to get this clip of the video like first of all i moved to the passenger side of my car because the angle with my camera camera was not angling at all and it's irritating and then i get all the way to this side of the car just for my actual camera to freaking say internal temperature too hot like sony what is going on like i don't understand anybody who got the sony zv1 bro do y'all have heating problems because like i can only have this thing on for literally five minutes and it's already talking about overheating like, it ain't even hot like ugh. anyways happy monday guys um i'm really excited i love mondays because it's like a fresh start of a new week well technically you could say sunday is but i just be feeling motivated on mondays i want to be transparent with y'all because yeah i post my like my weekly um saturday uploads and my fitness journey or whatever i'm not really making progress like how i should i started to track my journey i guess around february and it's now going on may and by now to me i should visibly be able to see a difference the reason why i want to say i want to be transparent with y'all is because if anything i feel like i'm i'm kind of going backwards and that can be a little discouraging you know because my goal is obviously to like lose weight and, and kind of get into my dream body but that's why i just want to be honest with y'all because it's one thing to say something but it's a totally different thing to actually do it honestly i don't think i've been holding myself accountable like how i should or like i haven't been really on myself and sticking to my goals and things like that so just kind of a little reevaluation of my situation um i i want to be i will be more stern and actually stick to my workout plans and diets and things like that but in order to even focus on like the outside and the physical you really have to work on the inside and your mental health completely if you don't have a strong mind or strong willpower then you're going to continuously backtrack and get behind and slip and things like that that's not what i'm trying to do like i'm really trying to grow here and i guess the first step is realizing that which i do so that's good but from this point forward and i feel like i say this in every video but truthfully like from this point forward i really want to figure out the things that trigger me like some of the days i don't feel like going to the gym was it something that happened to make me not want to go to the gym life situations can definitely have a factor in wanting to work out and overeating and things like that but yeah i just wanted to be honest with y'all and for those of you who do watch my videos i want to thank y'all for the continuous support but we're gonna get through this we're gonna get through this and i can't wait to see the change within myself and my body and mind i want y'all to be able to experience that with me it's hard like i feel like i'm putting myself in a super vulnerable position because it's like girl like if anything you look bigger on camera like how you creating a little workout like videos and things like that but yeah you getting bigger but i mean i guess that's all a part of the journey like not everything is peaches and cream so yeah i'm actually sitting outside of my job right now i'm getting ready to go in here and just create a little agenda for myself and write out like what it is i want to do day by day because i noticed what i i'm the type I like to know exactly what I'm gonna do when I'm gonna do it I like to be extremely organized like when what where why like that's me and that's how I function so I'm gonna go in here write out daily agendas because I think if you tackle things daily or like list by or you know thing by thing then I don't know it just makes stuff function a little bit easier in my mind and in my life but I don't know if I'm going to cook y'all seen I got all that freaking every plate delivered um I don't want it to go bad but I don't know if i really want to cook today we'll see because i don't really be feeling like it later on in the day but um yeah so far i did have these chips right here just a little snack good morning it's a good day um so y'all before i go into work i just decided to literally cook two hello fresh meals like what like who do i think i am because before like it was really hard for me. oh my gosh i zoomed in okay yeah before like it 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 just took so much for me to cook a hello fresh meal because i didn't feel like it but it's a new day and I literally prepared two 
meals. And I'm actually frying the bacon on one of them right now. This one is barbecue and caramelized onion. Yeah, so this is the one I'm making. Barbecue bacon and caramelized onion flatbread. One thing about it, every plate gonna send some flatbread. Y'all seen I just made one last night and it was bomb. I ain't complaining because they are good. The other meal I made was this and it's the honey chipotle pork chops. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, like it's pretty good. And to be honest, both meals didn't even take that long to cook. Um, So I don't even know why I'd be playing it like that. I just wanna show y'all how that um honey chipotle pork chops turned out though. So here it is. Ah, hold on. So here's this one. I put it in a little meal prep tray because I'm gonna get this one to my mama and then I got one for me. But it's just the Brussels sprouts, um, pork chops and potatoes. I tried a little bit of pork chop and I ain't gonna lie, it's pretty good. So I'm happy about that. I plan to eat this for dinner tonight after my gym workout or maybe before i don't know yet but this is what i plan on eating tonight and then i'm gonna just eat like the flatbread pizza for um lunch now that my bacon's almost finished i'm gonna go ahead and add my onion so that can cook down So I just took the flatbread out of the oven and this is the final product. It looks so bomb. Usually I do like a little TikTok video or reel recording me doing it, but I didn't do that this time because for one, it was last minute. Like I didn't even know I was gonna be doing all this cooking this morning, but it is what it is. Um, So here it is, it looks so good. This recipe right here was really interesting because it had me doing some little fancy stuff like it made me chop up a jalapeno, put it in a bowl, add lime, add sugar. So I was kind of like pickling the jalapeno. So I think that's really cool. The base like the sauce is barbecue sauce, brown sugar, what else? Um, like garlic powder, lime juice. So I'm really excited to try that. Yeah, I'm a little tired after all that cooking but I'm glad I got it out the way. In actuality, it didn't even really take that long, to be honest. I think I'm gonna start cooking my every plate meals, two of them at a time, because it's just a lot easier. And at least that way I know, um, you know, my meals ain't gonna go bad. But now I'm finna get in the shower, wash my hair, wash all this build up out finally, and probably go to the gym. And yeah, um, I guess I'm gonna take it from there. A couple of pack that kept in and I'm in and I'm out, ain't no time to be fucking up. I put on a shirt and I put on my pants and my boss nigga came for the sun is out. Pussy ass niggas, they talking that fuck. I'm taking it up and I'm on my The pain that I'm feeling is stuck. You lost time, make it in pain like I'm shitting these solids. The ops is outside and they fucking like talk. I'm taking my time, but I ain't on my home. Earn me these shots while I'm off through the jungle. And the ends me turning and shit sound like fun. And the first house I bought, they did that for my mom. And the first kiss I caught, I went down with a llama. And someone was hot, that shit felt like a sign. Cause my ex wanna come back for killing all the law. As soon as we fuck, she get hit with a block. Ice on my neck, on my wrist, it's a wall. Busting it down, but I need you to stop. I'm calling the promise to sit down. So I just got back from the gym and I had a really good workout. I did about 33 minutes in the elliptical, so I felt real accomplished. Y'all, I'm tired though, like for real. When I say my glutes are on fire, like I'm not even playing, y'all. Like I, I walked off the gym with my butt feeling bigger, legit, like. I had a really good workout. So now I'm just hungry. Um, I'm about to warm up my flatbread pizza that I made earlier. Yes, this will be the first thing I ate for today. And then, y'all you know, I'm still debating on um, whether or not I'm gonna eat my pork chop tonight. Good morning, guys. It's pretty early. It's only about five something in the morning. I'm getting ready early because I'm gonna take my mama to work and then I'm gonna go to the gym early instead of later. Or at least if I don't go later, I'll feel better because I went earlier. And I'm starting to notice 
I'm more prone to get things done earlier in the day compared to later. I'm not a night owl. So I'm just gonna do my hair. I just got out of the shower. By the way, I love this moisturizer. I really feel like it make a difference in my skin, y'all. It's like it give me a natural glow. And when I say this smells so good, I wish they had this in a perfume or a lotion because mm, it's just so soft. It smells like baby powder and just goodness. Like it really make me happy. <laughs> but look how this rub into my skin. So good can y'all see a difference and i got it from the dollar general so it was not that much money it was probably only between like three and five dollars and it's actually one of my favorite moisturizers compared to the high-end moisturizers that i've tried y'all do not sleep on dollar general dollar tree like no also guys i love washing my face with this in the morning because the eucalyptus in it, it just really like opened up the pores in my skin and I'd be feeling so refreshed and rejuvenated. Last night, I ended up, um, so the pork chops, I ended up eating that right after my flatbread, not gonna lie. Cute. Now all I gotta do is brush my teeth. So I don't know if I'm like actually recording a gym. I don't know. But if I don't, just know y'all, I'm going to be doing my, um, y'all know what I do, like my little elliptical. I'm going to do my little leg push, leg press, whatever exercise. And then maybe something for like the upper body, the arms, the machine that do this. What well, I work the abs, but yeah. Here is one of the yogurts that I picked up yesterday. Y'all, when I seen 25 grams of protein, I was like, what? I didn't even know yogurt can get that high in protein. Like, it's crazy. Here's the other one I got yesterday. Same vanilla flavor, but this one got um, 15 grams of protein compared to the 25. As far as taste, it's not bad. Granola to add to it. So one serving is one third cup and 130 calories per serving. So let me find a measuring cup. One third. Before I go, here is a quick fit check, or I guess you could say my gym fits. Here it is. Nothing too major, just a little sweater I got like years ago from Target. One thing about it, I'm gonna go to Target. I love me some Target. <laughs> but a little tank top with a little hole, if you can see that. But yeah, that is our gym fit for the day, or outfit, or both. <laughs>